Good morning, folks. Today we're checking in on severe weather on opposite sides of the planet, dangerous deep space discoveries with Chandra, and we're going to go over several items in the space weather realm, starting as always with the last 24 hours on our star. Modestly active day. Pops, surges, small flares, filament eruptions, coronal hole approaching central heliographic longitudes. While there isn't anything major coming our way at the moment, watch levels are high. The sunspots have been looking like they want to erupt, including a near eruption from a surge through the umbra of a southern group, and the filaments have been lifting as well, like this one off the departing limb on the south. With more filaments present and lots of sunspots, we're thankful nothing scary has been produced yet. We will be watching, and we'll also be watching the solar wind even if no significant eruptions occur due to an enhanced stream likely from that dark coronal hole. It's facing us today. Its solar wind will arrive near the weekend. Quick look at Kong Ray up next. The typhoon is going to hit Taiwan today. You see it on approach here with a very well-defined eye. After this, it's going to shift towards Japan, but for now, the island nation near China is on watch with the storm bearing down. We also have severe weather possible in the United States today. Tornadoes may drop due to a major convergence tail coming off a northern low-pressure cell. Precipitable water overlay here shows how wet, dry air, which is also a combination of hot and cold air, is slamming together along that convergence line. That's where the storms and tornadoes would be tonight. Eyes open. A gorgeous infrared look at star-forming regions reveals many new planetary systems developing, but which ones are already in trouble? Purple overlay of x-rays from Chandra shows where the radiation levels are likely way too high to support any kind of life we know of. The solar systems outside the purple return have the most protected environment for development. Folks, don't forget Observer Ranch's several upcoming events. The mini-conferences begin on Saturday. I'll be turning you into an expert in one day with all the time for questions you want. Also, folks, tomorrow the special issue of Observer Review will be sent to all subscribers. It's going to be a breakdown of all the recent stories on the galactic current sheet and its effects on our solar system right now, including the magnetic pole shift here at Earth and the reset of the disaster cycle. It's the best way to stay aware of everything going on in the science world with one to two significant issues released every month. Link is below. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.